for Zimbabwe. Class to Pagels with the Zimbabwe side, also shared how tall. He seems to have had a bit of flu over the last couple of days, but uh, Mr. Pagels looks fine. He says he's relaxed. The players have a job to do out in the middle of the park. So a photograph for the scrapbook or for Twitter and Facebook, whatever you choose. Zambia making just the one change then. The injury to Bruce uh, Musakanya, the teenage Red Arrows winger against South Africa. Too much for him to start the match. But uh, Herve Reynard starts with Alex and Gonga in the three strikers for the Frenchman today. And Gonga, Bonwell and Wapi, both from Manchunga Rangers. And Festus and Bewe for Nkana FC. It's a strong side, it's an attacking side. Zambia looking for revenge over Zimbabwe when they met last in a final of Kasafa. It was the last time it was played, and that was back in Lusaka in 2009. Atmosphere already electric. Uh, Zambia shooting from right to left in orange, and Zimbabwe will be looking to defend this That's Kasafa the trophy, trophy. then. That is up for grabs today. The Kasafa Trophy held currently by the Zimbabwean side. Four time champions looking to extend that margin of lead, even like Zirepi was injured. The fans couldn't have had a better start, or well, the Zambian fans anyway, in the stadium, couldn't have had a better start from Chipolo Polo today. Well, something no one would have imagined on four minutes because you always think that Zimbabwe will be very resistant from the very start but they were not settled quickly Perhaps, uh, absolutely no yeah. problems and look how far back Alex and Gong has come a little flick on in the wrong direction and no damage done as far as uh, Zimbabwe are concerned that's Eric Chipeta the right-sided fullback well Zambia playing Bono Mwabe currently as a lone striker up front and that's the plan to try and get him through those I'll be happy not to have too many injury worries Zambia to have this consolidated squad available to take on the Zimbabwean outfits Chibuiro holding on to the ball in that area not doing them much uh, favor it's now Zambia with the possibility of a cross Wape will uh, better settle for a corner except seems to have recovered from that knock rather nicely. Mpuku Mulengo is also a teenager, a 19-year-old from the same club as Stumbeko. Cross, and you can actually hear the difference. There have been more cheers than bulls. That's suggesting that Zambia is possessing the... Zimbabwe, the only two corners we've experienced in the match so far. Heda is over the top from Chipeta. We saw from the previous corner that Chipeta likes to be at the back of the penalty area. He is one to look out for. I think that is where there's what you may call a blind spot. You don't know what he's up to. And lucky with the Zambia survivor. And Danny Munyawa has every right to not to be happy at that point. Zimba Mambare. Well, back to his goalkeeper first by Devon Chaffa. Still no panic in the Zimbabwe camp. Been in cup finals before this team are well coached by Klaus Dieter Pegels. Our floor manager Chico standing in the background, making sure that uh, the trophies kept collected and uh, left alone by anybody that's close to it. Zvirekwi. We turned the wrong way because he had support coming from his captain. Now a chance for Kayo by referee Bernard Camille. Good news for the Zambian supporters is that Alex Nkonga is back on the field of play and only two minutes away from perhaps getting onto the physio's table and a bit of massage on his injured left ankle, maybe a bit of strapping or taping. Dibanda. Still Zimbabwe trying to get the acceleration going as much as they would have wanted. Opportunity. Well, Mashura with uh, a lot of uh, 
ability running forward. He overlaps well, but uh, that offside core not well received uh, by Zimbabwe. Nice turn from Ngonga. Away by Simba Mambare. Chafa. Now it's Virekwi. And again, the flow of the Zimbabwe play is just terrific to watch. Well, they found their feet. They are very... Tendai and Doro, cleared by Mtonga. Tendai and Doro, cleared by Mtonga. Well, one hour of football played in the Cassava Cup for 2013. It's been very entertaining. Look at the second half of Bobby pushing hard to get onto level terms. It'll be interesting to monitor that possession statistic. Later, later we get on in this encounter. In Dola, it's Kasafa Cup 2013. Zambia, Zimbabwe. Eric Chipeta. For Tenda and Doro, and Doro does get there first as well. Now his work out quite well. As we wreck, we just uh, the supplier to Ronald Chitio on the right hand side. 20 year old from Monomo Topa has played uh, in both opening matches in the starting lineup for Klaus or Dieter Pegels. Perhaps, uh, perhaps will fancy himself as an impact player in the final. To the live in Wanawasa Stadium in Ndola. Now, ten minutes away, plus a bit of stoppage time from seeing Zambia claim another title. Well, this has certainly been positive for support for the Kosafa in Zambia. And uh, to go down as a, a memorable Short tournament time. as well. They're all being very cautious, but good touch there by Chungwa. The cross did come, and it's a DB going down. It's better. A pick up by Jaure. The Zambians virtually winding down the goal pick. Yes. They're trying to make sure that, you know, this match ends in a goal. As far as that he made, it was a good day. As we see there now, Zambia winding down the clock. It will be interesting to see what the referee will do. Because he said three minutes, we've played one minute now. And it's optional time. It's optional time. Chibeta now to the far side. Blessing to Mamchere of Triangle, guiding it backwards. Chibeta knocking it to the near side here, finding Hadlai Zurekwi. And again, Festus Bewe flicks it forward. That one will be taken away by Chip Chip Eric Chibeta. Brilliantly done. Chingwach Chingwamchere now. Coolly laying it to the near side. Oh, Chibeta, I think we need to keep an eye on this young man. To me, he has got the pace, the power, the skill, all the things you need in a defender. Eric Chipeta from Wange. Thank yes. you. Uh, Eric Chipeta from Wange. We have seen him growing with, his, uh, with the Zimbabwe national team since he came in. He has done extremely well. And so far, he's doing very well. And uh, on Wednesday, I watched him playing against, against Monom Tapa. He was just above everyone. So that again to he's a player who plays for the Zimbabwean goal minder, Tafaza Dube. Chipeta. The man who is dictating the pace in defense lays it to the near side and uh, Mbewe, the Zambian danger man, always lurking around. As uh, Zimbabweans now take it away from them, Patson Jauri to Eric Chipeta inside his box. The enterprising against the Tory time, the young man from Triangle, Becky, is once again standing firm. Yes, Eric Chipeta is the, is the one who goes down. Because oh, that was one. Eric Chipeta, yes, actually. Eric Chipeta, he has been so outstanding in defense to try to make sure he closes as much as he can. We know that Zimbabwe, when they played against Zambia in the Kosafa, they played one of their best games, but unfortunately... That long cross comes in, nobody home for Zambia, but Eric Chipeta is there. He controls it well and keeps the ball in play. Yes, them Big, as strong. As they, can, they should not Eric allow... To expose their goalkeeper we know that the goalkeeper is very good but i think if he's really exposed then they can be danger they need to protect their goalkeeper as much as they can uh, uh, peter moyo 
we haven't seen much from him and I think he needs to raise up his game a bit. Yes indeed, as Chimamchere exchanges passes with Hadlai. Goal kick to Zimbabwe, the goalkeeper, Nabaza Dume, checks it short. Big Eric Chipeta lays it. Back again to him. Chafa. Early on, these are the two outstanding players, Chafa and Chipeta. Masiwisa, brought down, free kick to Zimbabwe. The Zambians locking the ball around. As Zimbabwe continue, here come the Zambians now, with Cabasso, stopped by Eric Speta quite easily, Rio Moyo, Peter Moyo.